All right, guys, today we're gonna to be checking out this video of this guy glamping. If you don't know what glamping is, it's like glamorous camping. They kind of put those two words together. It's where you're camping, but you got more necessities than at home than kind of like roughing it out. And this guy right here has one of the coolest tents I've ever seen, and he has some of the coolest equipment with him. Let's go ahead and check out this video right now. All right, let's start this. All right, this video was like 25 minutes long, so I kind of cut it up so we could see some of the best parts. I'll leave a link to the original video below. But man, look how big this tent is already. He's struggling to do it by himself. It's a pretty good sized tent. Probably being a lot easier with two people. See, these are one of these air beam tents. If you don't know what the air beam tents is, they have like industrial air tubes that go through the tent and you just set them to a certain PSI and you just inflate it. That's instead of using those poles that normal tents use. See, this probably went up in a good 15 minutes or so. Didn't take them much work, but to kind of help it inflate. Got some plastic windows. That's pretty cool. All right, you see those air beams? You see those going across the top there? Uh, kind of in that arch shape. Those are the industrial air beams, which I like better. And I'm getting a tent from Europe that's like that, a tunnel tent. It's a Campa Air. I think it's a Highland Air 6 or whatever I'm getting. But they, I find them to be a lot better because if you break a pole during a windstorm or something like that, then you're you're screwed with one of your poles. But the air beams, if, if something happens, they just bend down and they go right back up. So. I, you know, they're kind of uh, got their pros and cons. Yeah, that's pretty sick. You got some windows up top, get some good lighting in there. Yo, this thing's, it looks pretty big. You got some carpet he's putting down. That's pretty nice. Okay, I got carpets on two sides. And you can see, it looks like maybe he don't use it, but... You can see that centerpiece. It looks like there might be a doorway you could put there to separate the two areas. I don't think he uses it. But he has a lot of gear with him. Which is pretty cool. It's a pretty big space. What is this? An air gun? Okay, these little air guns. I've seen those on like TikTok shop and stuff. Ooh, what is this? Yeah, it looks, that's probably way better than sleeping on the ground. Of course, a cot. But he has like a, a bunk bed cot, which is pretty cool. I just use an air mattress. I got an inflatable air mattress. I prefer that. And I used to sleep on the ground when I was a kid. Sometimes out by the fire underneath the stars. Looks like he has an air mattress or an air mat. I don't know what he's filling up here. Can't be a bed. He already has the other one set up. That's a pretty cool air gun, though. Oh, it's a couch. My man is living good. He's in the couch, man. He's comfortable. Okay, we got like some some lights. He's hooking up like some chandeliers. Some pretty good lighting too. Oh, okay. Got himself a ceiling fan. That's what's up. Or is that another light? All right, it looks like he's setting up a, a table. Not a table. Dude got some good equipment though. It's He's already living pretty good with the couch and the cots. Some carpets. What is this? Some kind of table. No, it's not a table. No, oh, it's for his wardrobe. Well, how fancy is that? And he's like he's at home. That's kind of cool. All right, we got more tables, more tables. 
This dude must have brought all the tables. Okay, this must be his setup. Got another light. Little little med pack or something. Bro, this is already pretty fancy. Like you'd be pretty comfortable. Oh, here's all his uh essentials, like his cooking and all that stuff, huh? Yeah, it looks like it. There's his like single burner right there. Yeah. It's just him, so he just needs what a single burner all day. I mean you could use the fire, fire pit, grill, whatever. I like to cook over the fire. It's always pretty good. You bring yourself a little grate that sits over the fire rings and stuff like that they have. Bro, what is this? What is this? Another table? Whoa. Is that like a monitor, a smart TV or something? Big old tablet out of a suitcase? Whoa, where do you find that? I want one of those. That's sick. How's he powering this? Oh, go figure right here. He has a giant power bank. I've seen these on Amazon. I always wanted to get one. And he looks like he has a secondary battery for it too underneath. Well, that's pretty cool. That's how he's powering this whole setup. Charge your phones. Charge that little TV thing. Yeah, that's pretty sick. That probably comes with a hefty price right there. For sure. What is this? Oh, it must have been to that fire. Look at that. He got like a fire indoor for heating. That's what's up. Dude, that is, look at this. He's big chilling. He's big chilling. That looks super comfortable. If you're going to live, if you would do this, let me know. You got to let me know in the comments below if you would do this. Or you can almost like live there like that, man. Probably not a family, but as a single person, bro, he probably could be out there. Look, he got his lights outside. That's big chilling. Got the TV. Smart TV. Turns on the fire pit. Yo, that's what's up. That's cozy as hell. I wonder if that holds pretty good uh, air conditioner in the summertime as well. Like if you have a portable AC. And he's just big chilling. Look at that. Making dinner. Oh, yeah. Eating like a king. That's a pretty good setup. What's he doing now? Oh, he's dragging it outside. And look at that. It's got a fire ring right here. That's what's up, bro. He's big chilling. Bro, that's cool as hell. Now he's just chilling outside. Eating some chips by the fire or whatever that is. That's cool. All right, the rest of the video was him just going through his nightly routine and kind of waking up and doing his morning routine at that. If you want to see the whole video, I'll leave a link in the description below. I kind of cut it up so it's a little bit faster. If you like this video and you want to see more like it or others, let me know in the comments below. If there's a video you think I should react to, let me know in the comments below and maybe leave the link or something like that and we'll check it out. But like always, we'll see you on the next one. Peace.